Hi guys! Today I really wanted to show you my complete or I guess up-to-date Sunmi collection. Um, she's one of my very favorite idols ever. I'm sure I've mentioned that before but if you've not heard me say that then I'm saying it now. Um, we have not been playing music in the last two videos because we want to see if it is a positive change or a negative change because I don't know. We just thought maybe it didn't sound so good with it in the background and we also get like copyright striked before the video even goes up a lot of the times which kind of sucks so I hope that it's not too bad and I'm not too boring but let's get right into it I won't be showing anything Wonder Girls except for this because it is like her specific version but I do have Wonder Girls albums but I'm this is just like a strictly Sony collection and of course I love this it's not signed or anything it'd be great if I ever did get a signed one but this is one of my very favorite Wonder Girls albums, even though there's only like three songs on it. Just the aesthetics and everything from it are really nice. Um, actually, this is sort of irrelevant, but on Superstar JYP, Send Me is my strongest like set of cards, and then Wonder Girls is my second strongest, because I'd probably say they are my favorite JYP or previously JYP artists. So there's that. And then getting into Sunmi's uh, cello things, I have Full Moon here signed, and it's one of my most cherished items in my collection. It really means a lot to me. I love this. Um, the photo book isn't that like big, or it's and it's not like that nicely made, but it still is like important to me because it's signed, obviously, which means like she held it, and that's really cool. Um, and I don't know, it was her first in Full Moon is also one of, if not my favorite, uh, songs that she's ever had. And the B-sides on there are really good too. And to go along with it, I have the postcard set. It just comes in a plain red envelope, but I'll show you the postcards. This is a message from Sunmi. I can't read it, unfortunately. And then... Here is the first photo. You don't get that many, but they're really high quality and they fit really nicely in my binder. I just really, there, I think you can see it a little bit better that way. Love the aesthetics and the dance is so iconic. There's actually a video of Yua from Oh My Girl, who is one of my favorite members of that group, doing a cover of this song and it's, one of my favorite covers I've ever seen from a K-pop idol. It's really good. If you guys haven't seen it, you should look it up. So that's all of them, and the backs of all of them is exactly the same, whether it's horizontal or vertical. And I initially did not get these postcards um, with the album, and I was like kind of bummed because I was like, oh, you know, that's probably one of those things I'm never going to be able to add to my collection because they're really like hard to find and then eventually I was and I bought them and I don't know it was just like a really cool moment for me to be able to complete that. So moving on I have we'll go into Gashina. I have this signed promo CD with a personalized note on here. It's not personalized to me but still it's still really really cool and obviously her signature. If you want to see me take it out of this bag and unbox it, there's an unboxing on the channel. I kind of want to keep it in here. And then I have, oops, Gashina Special Edition. And this photo book and everything about this is just like absolutely perfect. We don't have an unboxing on the channel of it just yet, but maybe by the time this is uploaded we will. I'll just flip through it really quick for you so you get an idea. I think there's a lot of pages and like, I probably say aesthetic too much, but the aesthetic <laughs> is just stunning. And of course I really love how much creative influence she has um, over her work now. And I got this bookmark that came with it. It's not really a bookmark, it's kind of like a thinner piece of paper. But that's what everybody calls it, is a bookmark, so that's what I'll refer to it as. And I also have this photo card which came with it. I really want the other photo card too, but I can't find anybody selling it. So if you happen to be selling it or know somebody who is, gosh, she's so beautiful, 
Um, please let me know because I would really love to add that to the collection. There was two photo card options in case you guys didn't know. And here's the back. That's not a real signature, it's like a printed one, but still. I think her signature is so cute, especially the heart. Okay, and then that would move us on to heroin. And I have this signed promo CD, which has a message on it as well. I can't read it, and it's also not addressed to me. And there is also an unboxing on the channel of this. I am actually pretty proud of this. I hope this stuff doesn't come across the wrong way, but I'm the only person to have uploaded like an unboxing of the heroin promo on YouTube. So please check that out if you're interested. <laughs> That'd be really cool. Um, and I have the posters for some of these, but I didn't um, bring them down to unbox because it just seemed like a big, big hassle. And I didn't know if it would even fit. And then here I have Warning by Sunmi. Obviously by Sunmi. This is a Sunmi video. I'm so stupid. Um, and there's an unboxing of this on the channel as well. I really love the photo book, all the songs on here. I'm pretty sure she wrote and composed almost every single song on here, if not every single song, with help on some tracks. And I can't say honestly between Gushina and Warning. Uh, which photo book I like better because I like them both quite a bit. I do think Warning is a bit taller, but they're about the same amount of thickness. Yeah, it is a little bit taller. And in that came this lenticular bookmark, which I think is really cool. I try to be careful with it because I feel like a lot of lenticulars scratch very easily and the back is just plain white. And I got this photo card with it, which between the two photo card options, this is the one I prefer. I want to eventually get the other one, but I guess I'm like a little bit bummed out that they're so similar. It's like the same picture, except she's doing like a peace sign. And there's the back. But yeah, I guess the item that I'm most wanting to add to the collection next would be the um, Gashina photo card. That's like a grail item I'm really looking out for. I'll try to lay things out for you guys, but I'm not sure if the glare will make it kind of hard to see. <laughs> I've loved her since Wonder Girls. She was also always, excuse me, one of my favorite members, her and Sohi. Yeah, I wish Sohi would make a return to music, but I want her to obviously like do what makes her happiest. And if that's what she's doing right now, that's what she should be doing, in my opinion. Like, I don't want to be, like, a jerk or rude about it. Oh, no, the glare. Okay, I'll kind of sit it over there in the corner. <laughs> what grail items do you have, oh, no, in your collection that you would like to get some, that you never thought that you would get, I mean, and that you eventually did? I feel like that about a lot of the things laying out here right now, which, I don't know. Makes me really happy. Sunmi Goddess was smiling down on me. I... Okay, she's just gonna... Oh, she's glaring anyway. Here, I'll hold those up. So yeah, here's my Sunmi collection. Thank you so much for watching. I'm pretty sure that we have a Sunmi playlist, and if we don't already, then um, we'll make one by the time this comes out. And then there's these as well. Which item do you think is the coolest? Thank you so much for watching again. I think I already said that. Um, bye.